Time now for ABC4 News Sports with Dana Green. Time now for ABC 4 News Sports with Dana Green. Expectations are as high as they've ever been for the Utah football team. In fact, for the first time ever, the Utes were picked to win the Pac-12 championship at Media Day today. Plus, they had five players on the preseason All-Pac-12 first team. But now it's time to back up the hype. The Utes have gone from the hunters to the hunted. They are now the favorites to win the Pac-12. I, I don't think, think it's a negative thing. We're not, we're not running from it or trying to hide from it. It's just you got to handle it the right way and understand that at the bottom line, it doesn't mean anything. It's just a lot of people that think a certain way. That's all it means. But it is a nice acknowledgement for our players in the program that, hey, people think you guys are pretty good players. No, I'm not surprised. Uh, I think that the work that we put in last year definitely – uh, has catapulted us to this year. I think that what we're hunting for is something more than um, just winning games. It's definitely trying to get back to that Pac-12 championship game and win it and uh, hopefully get a berth into that Rose Bowl. A healthy Zach Moss could end up being Utah's all-time leading rusher. And with Andy Ludwig back as offensive coordinator, the Utes are hoping to complement their dominant defense with a consistent offense. Well, we think that uh, we're going to hopefully take a step forward this year offensively. Uh, getting Andy Ludwig back as our coordinator uh, is a big plus. Uh, last time around, you know, the 08 season, we were 13-0, you know, the last time he coordinated our offense. Utah's defensive line, led by Bradley and I, could be one of the best they've ever had. And Anai has been highly motivated by last year's loss to Washington in the Pac-12 title game. It stuck with me when, you know, when it was fresh, just like a fresh wound would. But it was definitely a motivation for us, uh, especially for us seniors. That's not how we wanted to go out. We won the South last year. We fell short in the championship game. So obviously the next step for our program is to try to win it all.